Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. The fetal pole is usually identified at approximately 6.5 weeks with transabdominal ultrasound imaging and at approximately 6 weeks too with transvaginal ultrasound imaging, although it may not be seen until approximately 9 weeks in some cases. When the fetal pole measures as greater than or equal to 7 mm, a fetal heartbeat should be detected. Take our lead. The fetal pole is a thickening on the margin of the yolk sac of a fetus during pregnancy. It is usually identified at 6 weeks with vaginal ultrasound and at 6 and a half weeks with abdominal ultrasound. However it is quite normal for the fetal pole to not be visible until about 9 weeks. Take our lead. Between five and a half to six and a half weeks, a fetal pole or even a fetal heartbeat may be detected by vaginal ultrasound. The fetal pole is the first visible sign of a developing embryo. If a vaginal ultrasound is done and no fetal pole or cardiac activity is seen, another ultrasound scan should be done in three to seven days. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. It contains a yolk sac, protruding from its lower part, but no embryo, even after scanning across all planes of the gestational sac, thus being diagnostic of an anembryonic gestation. A blighted ovum is a pregnancy in which the embryo never develops or develops and is reabsorbed. Make your mark, take our lead. The embryo keeps growing and can be seen as a speck on an ultrasound by around week five to six of pregnancy. Doctors can diagnose a blighted ovum using an ultrasound starting at around week seven of pregnancy. Imaging will show a smaller than normal and empty gestational sac, which contains no embryo. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.